Hello everyone and welcome back to Zootopia's Minecraft. It has been a seriously long time, and in the time I have moved house twice, I've finished my degree, I've bought a new graphics card, and well, genuinely, yeah, generally souped up my computer. So hopefully this is a lot better now. Things will be running a lot quicker, less lag, and I'll be able to have my render distance on something other than tiny. So I'm actually going to start a new world. Um, because it's 1.3 now, and it's soon to be 1.4, and I thought with a new computer, new house, new degree, let's just start a new world. So, let's go. I've called it a whole new YouTube world. A whole new YouTube world. So here we go. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Uh, it's... Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. Okay. Um. Yeah. Let's go. It's like we're on an island. My graphics are on fancy. Smooth lighting's on. It's lagging slightly, but hopefully that passes. Oh, there's some trees, some squids, some flowers. Okay, for this. Well, it's kind of a continuation of a series, really. The idea is generally the same. Get to the nether and just see how things go. So, without further ado, wood punching. Oh, yeah. Take that wood. And five. Oh, there's another one. Okay, let's grab that as well. Six pieces of wood. Let's get this one as well. <laughs> if you compare the graphics from this series to the last one, it might be a bit of a surprise. I can actually see through these leaves! I didn't know you could do that. Oh, fancy graphics. So there's a few more trees around. Now what I'd really like to do is go and find a jungle temple or a desert temple or just generally see some of the new stuff that's happening in 1.3. Um, actually this big tree can probably show us one thing. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Sideways logs. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's actually pretty cool. Anyway. I am actually lagging slightly. Uh, that might have something to do with Bandicam. Hang on a sec. Uh, what can we change? Um, um, uh, I don't want to turn anything off. Uh, uh, let's just turn off smooth lighting. Um, yeah, okay. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, some pigs and um, some kind of square looking cave. Okay, let's go check that out. Really, I want to find a good cave system and then I'm going to get some diamonds. And hopefully that doesn't take as long as it did last time. In fact, uh, yeah, I don't think I ever actually found diamonds last time, so... This is actually a square cave. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. This seems like a pretty good spot for a house, actually. Oh, wow. Ow. Ow, my legs. They are broke. Uh, new gravel texture. Uh, I like it. I think it looks good. Anyway. This looks like it could be a little cave system, so let's go check this out. Oh, yeah, that, that was a giant cave system. 
Anyway, there's coal here. Let's grab that. Uh, you notice my skin is the normal Steve skin. That's just because the internet was messing up and it wasn't loading my normal Tertonia skin. So just ignore that. It'll probably be back next episode. Okay. Grab this coal. Oh yeah. Experience. It is awesome, that new experience thing. You seem to get experience from mining coal. You don't get any from mining iron, I don't think. But you do get... You do get experience from smelting iron. And smelting most things in general, I think. Like, gold and stuff. And it really does help. I think I was playing on my friend's server, and um, I think I was, like, level 15 in about half an hour. So it, it's a really good way of getting experience early game. Actually means you can use enchanting tables without building a mob grinder, which is handy. Which will help us, actually, because we're probably going to need some enchanted stuff to get into the nether. Well, to not fail in the nether, anyway. Okay. Ow. That's a good load of coal. Get my crafting table. Okay. Up we go. I should... Yeah, okay. I'm gonna build... Oh, That's my pick. I am gonna build a stone sword, and then I'm gonna kill some of these sheep. I say sheep. I mean pigs. Okay. Punch the crafting table. Right, let's go. And get out of this. Uh, uh. Oh. Hello, pink sheep. Pig. Yeah. And I did complain on my other series that pigs don't drop any pork chops at all compared to cows dropping beef and them sort of, you know, healing the same thing. Now, pigs drop way more pork chops. They've actually become a good supply of meat again. So, we can go back to seeking out bacony goodness. No! No pig! No! Ow! Ow! My legs! Come back! No! Hello. Oh, it's very sad when they die. And the last one. Oh, genocide's always nice. Yeah, so that, like, three pigs, or, was it four pigs? Um, I think it was three pigs. Uh, and three from one, three from another, and one from the second one. So yeah, that's, that's awesome. It's really, really good. Oh, another one. Yeah. Oh, ten pork chops. That's amazing. Oh. Unsatisfying. There's more pigs down there. Or maybe pink sheep, I don't know. It's quite confusing. Is that... yeah. We've got a jungle biome over here. Oh, <laughs> Look at that little island. Oh! Pumpkins! Oh my god, this is amazing. Oh, I love pumpkins. Um... Ow. I'm getting a call. Oh my god. Oh, I'm gonna have to pause. Uh, uh. And I'm back. Oh. I was drowning a bit. These pink sheep look like pigs. Anyway. This looks like a pretty cool island. It's... This whole area is pretty cool, actually. It's like a bay and little islands and stuff. We got a nice little jungle biome here. Maybe there's... Oh, there's cocoa beans down there. Sweet. And hopefully, if we explore it, we might find a jungle. Whatever they're called. Oh, my god. That. <laughs> oh, my god. That is exactly what I needed. That is exactly what I was looking for. <laughs> Are they... I don't actually know how common they are, so they might be fairly common, spawn in most jungle biomes, but 
I don't think so. I know that cocoa beans are really common. They're pretty much everywhere. So seeing them is not surprising, but seeing this jungle ruin... <laughs> this is the first one I've seen, actually. Well, okay, I I've seen them on, you know, on YouTube videos and stuff, so... I'm not actually going to get hit by any traps, I don't think, anyway. I should be able to avoid them. There are sheep everywhere. Where's the entrance? There it is. Okay. Okay, so... We know that down there, or... Okay, let's just go down. Ah, okay, here are the levers. Um, I can't actually remember which ones to press. Uh... Uh, that's done something. Let's go and have a look. Uh, that's not right. You know what? <laughs> yeah, excuse the cheating, but, you know. I can't be bothered. Oh, rotten flesh and bones. Oh well. Kind of serves me right for cheating, really. I'm gonna take these things. That's redstone repeater. Redstone... Awesome. I might as well take the chest as well, actually. So, sticky pistons as well. Now, considering you have to find slimes to get them, they're incredibly rare. So, yeah, let's go the other side now. Uh, there, there it is. And there's the dispenser, so i just go this side. Should avoid it. Haha, <laughs> yeah, grab these arrows. And there is the next one. I, I can just grab them. Yeah, all traps disengaged. Gold ingots! <laughs> and rotten flesh and bones. I guess that kind of makes sense. If this is supposed to be like a tomb. Let's grab this redstone. Come here, redstone. Grab these as well, actually. Oh, can I find an arrow? There's no. Oh, something fired an arrow. Anyway. Yeah. Anyway. Gather this redstone. That's enough. Might as well take these dispensers as well, actually. Dispensers are cool. We can use dispensers. We can dispense minecarts and buckets of lava and buckets of water and stuff like that now, I think, with 1.3. Uh, there it is. Grab that. Awesome. And it's getting pretty dark outside now. In fact, it is dark. It's night time. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we better make some torches. Oh, four torches. And I guess I can live in this temple for now. <laughs> um, put up a bit of dirt. Very safe. And I don't think anything can get in from up here. No, I don't think so. Anyway, uh, uh, two more torches. Should I put them? Uh, I want to put them in the middle, otherwise I'll go crazy. Okay, that's good. That's good. Okay. Um, well, that's kind of dangerous. <laughs> Especially the number of times I've broken my legs this episode. Um, I'm hungry. Uh, okay, I'm going to grab some more stone and build a furnace. And I have an ample supply of stone here. Namely, in my house. So let's go and get some stone. Your stone. 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 I just need eight of you. Eight stone is enough. Wow, I'm really hungry. I'm going to start dying soon. Is that eight stone? That is eight stone. Oh, uh, quickly. Build a crafting table. Ah, uh, crafting table. Ah, uh, no. I don't want... No. Uh, why would I press T? No, I don't want to starve to death. I know I could just eat the pork, but yeah, I like to cook it. So 
So let's put that in there. No, oh, I can put some chests down actually while we wait. And I will fix that later. Don't worry. Dump all this stuff in there. And let's. Oh! Ha! Oh, awesome! You get experience from cooking as well. Alright, sweet. Let's eat these poor chops. Delicious, delicious pork chops. Uh, I eat this last one. Oh my god. Oh, wow, that was terrifying. <laughs> well, that's why you build dirt doors. <laughs> Uh, yeah, uh, on that note, um, I think we'll finish the episode. <laughs> I've been Tetonius, guys. Uh, see you next time. Bye!